Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Yansa's Universe. It is me, Yansa. This is going to be an all signs next 48, okay? This is your next 48 reading. Whatever comes out, remember, only take what resonates, leave the rest for somebody else. I'm going to take a break from reading. You guys, I've already done your April monthlies. I'll get the weeklies out as well. Please check out all of the all signs readings. I have a lot of content for y'all, so y'all have enough to watch. Remember, not every message is your message. Not every card, not every storyline will resonate. Only take what resonates. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, protect me as I go within the tarot. Keep me safe. Close my doors so no negativity sneaks in. And only the ones I've called upon are welcome here. My shame. All right. All the way from Aries to Pisces. This is an all signs reading. Like I said, you can like, share, subscribe. Leave me a comment. Leave me a love donation and book a personal reading with me. That'll really help me, you guys. Okay, we have the King and Queen of Wands out. Okay, Aries. Big energy. Show up and show out. Okay. Let's start it off big. Who you watching or who watching you, Aries? Let's go. What's for Aries? What do you have for Aries in the next 48 hours? Tell me about Aries, please. Five of Cups. You're sad or someone is sad. All right. Queen of Swords. Because you stopped talking to them, they stopped talking to you. And you don't see your way forward, so you just decided to be single. You're not tripping anyway. Your money's good. You say, you know what? Holding back is the best thing I could have ever done for myself. And you're going to be shown that this next 48 hours. Somebody who may try to come back and talk to you, a past friend, lover, family member, whoever. You're going to remember why you stopped talking to them in the next 48 hours. You will remember why you slowed communication. Clarify the five of cups for Aries. The sun. It could have been a Leo, but you decided you want to move on to something happy, something better. You say, you know what? You're going to do the ghost in this time. Could be dealing with a Virgo. Clarify the queen of swords for Aries. The five of wands and the devil. This air sign is toxic or this Capricorn is toxic. This person, there is no love when they talk. It's all hate, envy, jealousy, lies. I don't know who this queen of swords is or this Capricorn. It's just this fighting, arguing. Next 48, don't let them trigger you. And you will remember exactly why you don't fuck with these people. You remember why you don't go to this place anymore. You remember exactly why you don't do something anymore. Clarify the two of swords. Five of Swords, Conflict and Defeat. Clarify the Ten of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles. Clarify the Ten of Pentacles and the Five of Pentacles for Aries. The Two of Wands, exactly. You remember why you decided to just stop fucking with these people, just do your own thing. You decided that this is why you distance yourself. You could be dealing with the Aries, Pisces, any Earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Leo. Give me another storyline for Aries. Aries, I'm telling you, you're going to remember exactly why you stopped fucking with these people or that person this week, this weekend. The next 48 hours, you're going to remember why. Give me another message for Aries, please. What's going on for Aries in the next 48? Next 48 for Aries. Three of Cups, friends, family members. This might be the same storyline, just saying. Nine of Cups. Okay, you're happy. Okay, you talk to other people. Okay, we got the King of Swords. The last spread was the Queen of Swords. A Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You could be on the same energy, save wavelength, or this is another Aries. It's Or it's somebody you're competing against. Okay. I get it, somebody you're competing against. Because we had the Queen of Swords in the last spread. Now we have the King of Swords in this spread. Except on one end, you're going to remember exactly why you stopped fucking with a certain amount, certain type of people or stop fucking with this person. And on the other hand, because I feel like the King of Swords is you, honestly. I know you're an Aries, but I feel like this King of Swords is you. You're, this is your energy. On the other hand, you're having fun. You're out celebrating. Wish fulfillment. Drinking. Having fun. Eating. Loving yourself, 
you're the life of the party three of three of um cups a lot of communication just looking sexy beautiful traveling just having fun so i feel like i don't know if you're competing with someone maybe you and another person used to be friends you were the close friends y'all stopped talking and so the person you stopped talking to started hanging around people and you stopped hanging around with them and like they would do a bunch of bullshit and you remember why you stopped hanging around with them and you were like you'll never get anywhere if you keep hanging out with them and they're like yeah i will these people are for me so now you two are in competition to see if these people are good people or not this don't make no sense um you're not hanging out with them they are hanging out with them and i guess it's just some type of competition on who can be happiest just forget all of that i don't i don't know that was weird let's keep going clarify the three of cups for aries king of cups you're dealing with the cancer pisces of scorpio you love this person and they this is a very positive person the hair fence ace of wands whoever this person is is libra taurus gemini aquarius cancer pisces sagittarius whoever they are high vibrational energy this person knows what they're talking about. No confusion when you guys talk. It's always clear. You always understand what they're saying. They always understand what you're saying. If there is a miscommunication, they're mature enough to have a talk with you. And it's like, yes, I'm so glad that I stopped fucking with these people from the past because the people you're dealing with now, these are great people. You're having fun. Okay. If you haven't found these people yet, they're coming into your life, Aries. So don't worry. And it's like, you don't ever have to look back on that bullshit. You, you don't ever have to look back. Turn your back on them. You don't ever have to look back. This is fast forward movement. You made the decision to just keep going. And this looks good. You're having fun. You're appreciated here. People are celebrating you here. Okay, very highly favored. Adored as well. People come to you for advice. You're soothing as well. People soothe you or you soothe them with your voice or your energy and things like that. And just a lot of fun, passion, creativity, sex as well, okay? Your wa your garden is being watered. I was going to say your water is being gardened. <laughs> Moving on, Taurus. Next 48 for Taurus, please. Taurus. Next 48 for Taurus. Six of Pentacles. You're giving to someone... Or someone is holding back from you. And as soon as I say holding back, we have the strength card. Ace of Pentacles, Eight of Cups. Someone declined your offer or you're declining someone's offer in the next 48 hours. Clarify the Six of Pentacles for Taurus. Three of Swords, exactly. Somebody was breadcrumbing. What you don't know is this person took a leap of faith somewhere else. Very toxic. They're vain. All they want to do is show off. Um, as soon as they get what they want, they up and leave. It could be a Capricorn, Leo, Pisces, Aquarius. I heard Scorpio as well. We have the sun. It could be a Leo. This person is very shallow, okay? A very shallow person could be coming towards you in the next 48 hours. Clarify the Seven of Swords for Taurus. Ten of Wands. These lies are a burden. Don't believe them. Do not believe them. This person is coming in to lie to you just to get you stressed out. Okay, it could be your child too. I'm sorry, but that's what I heard. Clarify strength. Clarify strength for Taurus. Three of Cups. Yeah, hold back. That's going to be the best thing you can do. Just keep moving forward. Don't pay this person no fucking mind. Keep moving forward and end that shit. You know why you ended it. Okay, Ace of Cups, you have someone who loves you. Someone who loves you. You love yourself. Okay, so many blessings when you just block this person and ignore this person. Ignore them. Keep moving forward, okay? Just keep moving forward, Taurus. Clarify the Eight of Cups. The Knight of Wands is a Sagittarius, an in-and-out person, very immature, okay? This person is coming to throw off your groove. They're just coming in to see if... What do they even want? Clarify the Ace of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. The Lovers, Knight of Pentacles. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. They want their family back. It's a Virgo. But this person has baggage. A lot of baggage. Hella baggage. 
all right if this is a new person coming in um you may see long term and potential with them but they have hella baggage all right too much of a burden you're gonna have to carry their baggage for them you're gonna have to feed them bathe them clothe them all of that extra shit so do this person have a child because them and they child they trying to move themselves and they child into your house taurus or this is what you're doing this is someone who cannot provide for themselves all right you can be dealing with the um, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Leo, Virgo. Give me another storyline for Taurus. Everybody's probably going to get two damn storylines. Every shit. All right. What's going on for Taurus in the next 48? Four of Swords, get rest. Please get some rest. You be dealing with a Libra, but the best thing for you was balance and what's fair. What's bear? Okay. I don't know if somebody's name is bear or bear. Bear naked. Bear back. Bear. I don't know. So what's best for you and what is fair is for you to just get rest. You got other things to do, other things to think about that you're manifesting. Okay, a lot of things are coming to you. Memories. Spirit is saying, block that shit out. Fuck the past. So, you're going to be thinking about the past in the next 48 hours. Fuck it. Block it out. Keep moving forward. Okay, Spirit says so. Because it, it's just no growth here. It's a burden. It's a burden. Yeah, no. So, yeah, the best thing for you to do is just keep moving forward. Um, pay attention to what it is you're manifesting. I see, I do see energy of like a past energy, but Spirit is saying do not entertain that. They're specifically saying don't entertain it. Seven of Wands like push the bullshit out push it out or this is if it ain't nothing from the past it's past things like memories and old habits and ways of thinking and speaking and doing and feeling spirit is saying like get all of that out your system like i'm getting like a regurgitating i don't know if you're throwing up this weekend purging this weekend crying and sulking and stuff for for the next 48 hours but spirit spirit is saying get all of that stuff out Get all of that stuff out. You could be detoxifying. Okay? Get all of that stuff out. All of it. So, I don't know if you're drinking some type of, like, detox tea or taking a laxative or something. All right. Gemini. Next 48 for Gemini. Next 48 for Gemini. Next 48 for Gemini. Nine of Wands. Okay. Ten of Cups. All the hard work that you've been putting in, you're going to um, reap the rewards. Uh, in the next 48 hours, you will be reaping the rewards and benefits of the hard work you've been putting in. The self-love and self-care and holding your high standards and boundaries, it will pay off. I see you're gonna. it's going to be paying off in the next 48 hours. All right. Definitely. Clarify the nine of wands for Gemini. It's too much. Sorry, y'all. Sorry, sorry. Who could clarify the nine of wands for Gemini? Seven of cups. Clarify the nine of wands and the seven of cups. Knight of wands. Ooh. You could be doing something a little reckless this in the next 48 hours. And I'm not going to lie. It looks like you're going to enjoy it. <laughs> it looks like you're going to enjoy it. For real. Clarify the Ten of Cups. The Ace of Wands. Exactly. Don't get nobody pregnant. Ace of Swords. Two, two Wands. The Ace of Swords and the Ace of Wands is dicks. Okay. These are male phallics. Y'all know what it is. Okay. 
Do not get nobody pregnant. Okay? Because you got your wand in your hand, too. I hear you on your phone. You got your phone in your hand. You drinking. Which one? Which one? Which one? Which one? You fishing in the next 48 hours. You going to catch your fish, too. Uh, clarify the six of wands. The devil. Yeah, I told you. You going to catch your fish, too. Yeah, they see you. They see you. They going to see you. <coughs> I'm going to catch some water. I need some water. Fudge. Oh, clarify the six of wands from the devil. You keep dealing with the Capricorn. Clarify the six of wands from the devil. Six of cups. You trying to get your ex back? You thirst trapping. You said they going to remember me. They going to remember me, the cherry. How do I get this ball rolling? <laughs> I see you getting exactly what you want in the next 48 hours. Six of swords. Yeah. That reaction you wanted, you getting it. Okay, if, if you wanted a reaction from somebody, if you wanted to see how somebody was doing without you, you're going to see it. High Priestess, you're going to get the information some way, somehow. <laughs> Ooh, clarify the star. Clarify the star for Gemini. The Ace of Pentacles, exactly. You get exactly what you want. Judgment, some type of decision, some type of manifestation. Clarify. The Empress, yeah, you get exactly what you want. You getting what you want. Clarify um, the Fool and the Empress. Five of Pentacles. It's okay. We got the match right here. So your divine pair, your divine union, it is right here with the Fool card. If you take that leap of faith, but I see like be careful what you wish for because. Why is there resistance? Clarify the Five of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands. I wasn't ready. They're not ready. Ten of Swords, Eight of Pentacles. They're not ready. They're still working on themselves. Nine of Swords. Clarify the Five of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands for Gemini. Okay, the Ace of Cups. There is love here. What happened? Nine of Swords. Somebody, I hear somebody is in the hospital. This is not for everybody. Somebody is in the hospital or somebody is on bed rest. Um, someone is suffering. I don't know if someone is pregnant. Is in the hospital giving labor. Or lost the child. Because here's the union right here. You get exactly what you want. What's the price? I hear at a price. What is this? The world and the moon. With the page of swords. Some type of information that don't... You get some type of information and it don't sit well with you. It has you stressed out. You get exactly what you want. But I feel like, what is, I, you, you're getting what you want, but maybe this isn't what the other person wants. Yeah, eight of, oh shit. The, yeah, the eight of swords. You get what you want, but it puts somebody else in a mental prison. It's not what the other person wants. The Nine of Swords keeps coming out. Someone is stressed. Someone is not happy. We have the King and Queen of Wands. A pair again. Maybe someone does not want this. Someone does not want this. Or someone is afraid. That's what it is. They're afraid of this connection. This strong connection. We saw two pairs. Moving on. Cancer. Next 48 for Cancer. King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Queen of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay, Six of Pentacles, making things work. King of Pentacles, Seven of Wands. Why do the Seven of Wands keep coming out for every single body? Clarify the King of Swords. You're thinking of something or you're saying something? You're stressed. You're thinking of something, Cancer. About a Capricorn or something very toxic. Clarify the Devil for Cancer. Cancer. 
has something to do with your child or this offer or this Capricorn. Clarify the Queen of Cups. This is you, Cancer. The Emperor. Okay. In Aries. Some type of communication from a boss, your father, a masculine, a Virgo, Aries, or Capricorn. You're having a talk or a discussion. Clarify the Six of Pentacles. The King of Wands. There's a lot of people here. King of Wands, Queen of Cups, King of Swords, the Emperor, King of Pentacles. This is a lot of people here. Clarify the Six of Pentacles and the King of Wands for Cancer. The Hierophant, the Ten of Cups, and then the Five of Swords. Something about the family. Queen of Pentacles. So here's a match right here. King and Queen of Pentacles. Someone... um someone's husband and wife is talking to you you're talking to someone's husband and wife you're getting advice in a relationship so somebody's giving you advice you're going through some bullshit with your partner you're not seeing eye to eye so you're getting advice from a married couple okay clarify the king and queen of pentacles the page of wands on how to raise your child five of pentacles someone walked out on you and your child The Four of Swords. You need financial help. The King and Queen of Pentacles and then the Five of Pentacles. There's someone helping you financially. Clarify the Seven of Wands for Cancer. Two of Cups. Okay, there's love here. The Sun. Something about a child. Ace of Cups. So what I'm seeing is, okay, so what's this energy right here? King of Swords, Nine of Swords, the Devil, and the Page of Pentacles, the Hangman. Okay, so what I'm hearing is you're going to get a call from your boyfriend, girlfriend, or your child. They got in trouble with the law. King of Swords, Nine of Swords. They got in trouble with the law. They got caught doing something, and they're in holding You don't know what to do so you're calling you're calling around hey i don't know what to do so and so is I've, i haven't heard from so and so i haven't seen so and so i can't find them or i got a call from someone saying so and so is here they're in trouble with the law or they did this they got caught doing that i need help i don't know what to do i need the money to get them It's so crazy because on one end you have the devil and all this negative energy. Then on the other end you have the sun, two of cups, and the ace of cups. So I'm just hearing like someone is coming to the rescue. The rescue. I don't know who it is. But like someone is coming to help you. This is your energy, the queen of cups. This Aries or this boss, your husband, or... Some masculine energy, they're coming to help you out because I don't know if you get in trouble by the law. I don't make sure you have your wallet on you. Do not be speeding. Make sure you have your ID and your insurance as well. Cause make hmm. also this could just be something as little as you go to the store and you forget your wallet in the car. Somebody pays for your stuff. I'm just seeing somebody helps you. Somebody basically saves the day. You get caught in some type of bind or some type of pinch, okay? Or you get held up somewhere and you may not have enough money or something like that. Someone comes to help you. Someone is coming to help you. I don't know who it is, an older person. I see a lot of people actually coming to help you. The king and queen of pentacles, okay? They love you a lot, okay? Whoever these people are, they love you a lot could be your family we have we do have the ten of cups right here i saw the two of cups i'm not I'm, i don't see that that's a relationship though i don't see it's a relationship moving on leo next 48 for leo next 48 for leo
We have the Ten of Swords, an ending, okay? But you're happy about this ending, okay? You're getting your money together, you're resting, you're not worried about nobody, you're focused on yourself. Clarify the Ten of Swords for Leo. The Four of Wands, whoa, was there a breakup, an ending? Clarify the Ten of Swords and the Four of Wands for Leo. The Queen of Wands. So you did something, you said something, you cut something off. So you can get more stability. Maybe you stopped eating and you're fasting. It's something that's like, it hurts. So maybe you're fasting from your phone, fasting from TV, fasting from eating. Um... There's something you're, or you're working out. It's something that hurts, but it's, I guess it's helping you in some type of way. Working out, getting in shape, because you're happy about it. You're happy about the results. Nine of Cups. Okay, clarify the Nine of Cups for Leo. Okay, the Hanged Man. Clarify the Nine of Cups and the Hanged Man of Pisces. I saw the King of Pentacles. I should have pulled him out. All right, forget it. Clarify the Nine of Cups and the Hangman for Leo. The Emperor and everything's fine. So something about an Aries. Two tens came out. Both the Ten of Swords have come out, Leo. So you have stopped talking to somebody. You've taken back control of the situation. It's something you said or maybe some information you heard. Clarify everything is fine in the Emperor for Leo. The Chariot. Something about your car. Something that's made balanced. A new opportunity or option is opening up for you. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Leo. Judgment, a decision. Page of Wands. Okay, a decision after some communication. So, why are these two tens out? You're doing something and it might hurt you to do it, but it's for the best. It's, it might hurt you to spend this money, but it's for the best. It might hurt you to have to do this fast or give this up, but it's for the best. It's for your betterment. So you could be throwing a lot of things away, selling your car, doing something. But it's to help you. We have the Four of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Clarify the Ten of Swords, Four of Wands, and Queen of Wands for Leo. The Two of Swords, a Libra, a stalemate. The Clarify the Two of Swords. Six of Wands, some type of victory you don't see coming. After a lot of hard work and heartbreak. So it's like what you don't even realize, all of this pain that you've been going through. Like spirit is basically about to give you a big blessing. You don't see it coming. The two of swords, they've blinded you to it. Okay. Give me another story. You could be dealing with an aries leo sagittarius aries strong we mainly got aries cancer sagittarius or an earth sign give me a different story for leo next 48 for leo Let me get these cards to shuffle right next 48 for leo Next 48 for Leo. The chariot could be dealing with a cancer. We have Aries coming out. We have everything is fine. All of the same cards. Golly, I thought I shuffled this pretty good. Something about an Aries. All right, for real this time. For real this time, Leo. Give me a different storyline for Leo. Ooh, Two of Cups, Knight of Wands could be a Sagittarius, Page of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Queen of Cups, Page of Wands. The Ten of Wands keeps coming out. Clarify the Two of Cups. There's love, a confession of love, a relationship, 
or just equality next 48 for you leo clarify the two of cups for leo four of swords rest thinking recuperating and then the sun you a child you're having fun just loving on yourself i hear you're going to the spa you could be going to the spa but um you're loving on yourself next 48 for you leo something makes you happy as well clarify the sun for leo clarify the sun for leo the empress okay your mom comes to visit you you and your mom are having a really nice conversation um i saw the ace of swords you could be learning that you're pregnant you and your person are trying to get pregnant i just see good news in regard to you growth and expansion or a mother figure you're having a good talk everything is good clarify the knight of wands the eight of cups you you walked away from some type of in and out energy clarify the knight of wands and the eight of cups the hermit you you yeah you walked away from a virgo a virgo walked away from you or this virgo is coming in someone that you haven't talked to is coming in to talk to you i do not read i don't like reading like that but this is what i'm seeing the knight of wands in and out energy fast communication could be sex as well and then eight of cups emotional distance the hermit completely gone so i don't know what's going on with the two of cups everything's good a relationship the four of swords you're getting rest rejuvenation the sun happiness leo i'm hearing okay that's weird if you tell somebody you're pregnant it's gonna make them fall back from you yeah seven of wands it's gonna make them fall back i don't know if you're doing something or saying something because the knight of wands is doing something or saying something sexually and this in and out energy is going to make somebody fall back so if you're talking to somebody and everything's good as soon as you start acting different they will fall back leo or this person starts acting weird in and out distant and then ghosting you clarify the page of swords Clarify the page of swords. Justice could be dealing with a Libra. You at the bottom of the deck with the lovers. Clarify page of swords and justice for Libra. Two of pentacles. Somebody probably had other things going on in their life. Yeah, ten of wands, the chariot. Somebody up and left, crash and burn. So, and then the seven of swords, five of cups. So I'm seeing you, you've been ghosted by somebody. This looked good two of cups this is great you two get along looks like a nice connection that you're in then one minute they're gone then with the justice card could have been a libra this person still watches you or some or it is some information that they found out that made them not really know how they felt about you so they think they found out something about you leo clarify the queen of cups The Eight of Wands, you might hear from them. We have the lovers again. Clarify the Queen of Cups and the Eight of Wands. This is love messages for me. We have the Emperor right here. A divine union, a divine match. So let me find out you you found your soulmate and you didn't realize it. And this person up and left. Or your soulmate found you. You didn't know y'all were two soulmates and you up and left. Somebody treated this connection like it was nothing. But it wasn't nothing. This is actually a very strong connection. Could have been a Scorpio. Here's the Hierophant right here. Like, what the fuck? Clarify the Page of Wands. The Star could be an Aquarius. Clarify the Page of Wands and the Star. I hear good communication. Very soft and loving communication with the Ace of Cups. So I see somebody. Somebody was an idiot. And this is not your ex. This is not your ex. There are no negative cards here. The devil's not here. The seven of swords isn't here. Five of swords, three of swords. None of that shit is here. It is not your ex. This is somebody who didn't realize that you two had some type of spiritual connection. They up and left with the lovers. Yeah, this is a soulmate. It could be another Leo. You didn't see it. 
Ace of Pentacles. I see this person coming back and saying, I don't know exactly what they're saying, but in my head, what I'm hearing is, hey, did you feel like this? Because I didn't realize that I felt like this. And you're going to be like, come to think of it, yeah, I actually do feel like this. I didn't realize it either. So I think that spirit put you and this person together, but minus the scary tie. You know how you can feel a tie to somebody and it's kind of scary, like how strong the connection is? Spirit put you and this person together and have put a cloak over both of you guys' eyes, the veil, so you two wouldn't run. But it looks like both of you still fucked it up anyway because somebody left or stopped talking or withdrew. I see this person coming back. Or this is just the energy, Leo. Damn, I wasted a lot of time on y'all. Virgo. So, Leo, you could be dealing with my bad, y'all. You could be dealing with the Virgo, Aquarius, Aries, Libra, Taurus, Leo, Virgo, like I said, Sagittarius, Libra. All right, Virgo. Let me hurry these up too. Virgo, next 48 for Virgo. The world card, closing cycles. You can be dealing with the Pisces. You're being divinely led. Six of Wands and the victory. A lot of love and success. We have the Five of Pentacles, the hangman. Okay, so I feel like emotionally you feel a little left out in the cold. And what did that say? Emotionally you feel left out in the cold. And here you are right here with the hermit card. I don't know. I'm just reading these cards super good today, y'all. The girl got a good shuffle in, but <laughs> I'm feeling the energy. All right. Clarify the world for Virgo. The magician. You're manifesting the door to open or do the door to close. Clarify the world and the magician for Virgo. The queen of wands. It's an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius that you stop talking to or you're trying to Open that door again. Clarify the high priestess for Virgo. Seven of Pentacles. You had some time apart from this person with the moon. I feel like you could be done with the Cancer or Pisces. A lot of deep energy. Clarify the high priestess and the Seven of Pentacles. Okay. Your intuition is telling you to take your time. Be different this time. Be different. Try from a different angle. See it from a different perspective. Okay, and I feel like your intuition is telling you to stop being a certain way as well. Clarify the six of wands for Virgo, the emperor. Everybody's getting the emperor. You could be dealing with an Aries. Clarify the six of wands and the emperor. The king of swords. You're saying something. Taking back control of the situation. We have, here's your match right here. The queen of swords. But I don't, I don't know if the queen of swords is playing these games or it's you. Because here's... <laughs> Here's the match right here. Between you and your person is a bunch of fuck-ass mind games and a bunch of bullshit, a bunch of avoiding, a bunch of talking shit. Both of you talk mad shit, too. Yeah, you do. Both of you. Y'all talk hot shit. And it's probably either to each other or, or to other people. So what's standing in between you and your divine match is a bunch of, I'm better than you, fuck you, you ain't shit, cussing, yelling, arguing, lying, cheating, manipulation, very immature energy. Maybe this is why your intuition is telling you to be different this time. Your intuition is telling you, just be different this time. Just have control of yourself, control of your temper, okay? Don't get, I hear, don't get mad. Don't get mad. Clarify the uh, King of Cups. <laughs> Four of Swords. Chill. Clarify the King of Cups. Yeah, three of, three of Swords. You might still end up getting mad. <laughs> you might still end up getting a little upset. Here's your match right here. <laughs> Y'all are lovers. <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny. I feel like this person 
makes you mad on purpose because the queen of swords came out for them the queen of swords and the seven of swords it came out for them so they always talking shit and they think it's funny but it's not so this person plays too much <laughs> they talking that fucking shit okay well, next 48 for virgo <laughs> the page is swords six of swords the six of cups <laughs> nine of cups <laughs> You have a plan, okay? When you come to this person, you're not gonna let them ruffle your feathers. You're not. You've been working. A, you've been working on yourself a lot. You're not gonna let them ruffle your feathers. You got this under control. You rehearsed this over and over again, okay? You could be dealing with the Leo. If you are dealing with the Leo, yeah, this person talks shit, okay? Don't let their demeanor um. Don't let their demeanor uh, make you smaller, Virgo. Don't let them do that shit, okay? What's what's the outcome for Virgo? I got to see. Next 48 for Virgo. What's the outcome? <laughs> the moon is a secret. It's a secret. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, shit, Virgo. It's up to you. Are you going to lose your cool? <laughs> Are you going to lose your cool, Virgo? Are you going to let them ruffle your feathers? Oh, shit. Okay, I do see um, you having fun. Next 48, you're having fun as well. I do see a connection um, that's coming up for you, Virgo. I don't feel like this is a past energy. This is beautiful, loving, caring energy with a Gemini or a water sign, okay? A lot of love, self-love as well. Your person is a piece of work, boy. <laughs> Libra. <laughs> Libra. Next 48 for Libra. Next 48 for Libra. Next 48 for Libra. You could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. There's some heartache here for some reason. Your person is hurting or you are. Yeah, it's you, Libra. Seven of Wands. You just you don't want to talk to nobody right now. You want to protect yourself. Something has been very hard for you, Libra. Clarify the Queen of Cups for Libra. Six of Wands. Okay, victory and success. We have the Two of Cups here, a connection. But here's self-sabotage. Self-sabotage. This person can be way younger than you. Clarify the Three of Swords for Libra. Next 48 for Libra. Clarify the Three of Swords. The star healing could be an Aquarius. But it's like this person is taking their time, pending. Like, will they? will, will there be healing? You don't know. Like, I hear pending. Something is pending. A transaction, um, someone's feelings, or a decision is pending. Clarify the Empress. You need to see how something else pans out first. Clarify the Empress for Libra. The Eight of Swords, exactly. Something is pending. With the lovers, justice, a verdict is, you're waiting on a verdict, a decision. Okay, maybe you fell in love with someone who was already in a connection. You're waiting to see how that works first before, or they're waiting to see. I don't fucking know. Clarify the Empress and the Eight of Swords for Libra. Three of Pentacles is probably another person here. Queen of Wands and the Devil. A toxic connection with drugs, sex. Clarify the Queen of Wands. Page of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, and the Hangman. Someone is in jail or something. Someone's in jail or something. Y'all see me? I put my lashes on. It's cute. Okay, whatever. But, um, <laughs> uh, Libra, I have to tell you, and I'm just going to tell you, um, you need to ask this person how old they are. 
ask this person how old they are libra and if you don't trust their age that they give you ask them for their id that's act do not ask them for their id do not fuck with them until you know how old they are libra that is all i can tell you because remember i said i feel like this person is way younger than you i said that in the beginning before i even got this message that popped in my head you need to make sure you know how old this person is because they're younger than what they're telling you. They're lying about their age, Libra. I'm telling please, Libra. They're lying about their age. Don't do it. Don't do it, Libra. Don't do that shit. Um, don't do that shit, Libra. And watch your kids as well. Don't don't send your kids to know whoever the fuck you think you thought was gonna watch them. No. Nope. You're gonna have to watch them yourself. Watch your kids yourself, Libra. Watch your kids yourself. Okay. Give me another message for me. Temperance could be dealing with the Sagittarius, King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Page of Cups. Yeah, I know watching these kids is hard, but damn it, you're going to have to do it yourself. Clarify temperance. The Queen of Wands. Okay, it's the Sagittarius you're dealing with. Clarify temperance and the Queen of Wands. The High Priestess. What's the secret? The Devil card right here. Something toxic, bro. The Devil, Nine of Wands, Ten of Wands. What is this? You're stressed out to the max. Okay, clarify the high priestess, what she's saying, what she's doing, or what is her secret that she's keeping. Clarify the high priestess, or what is the intu intuitive message? Seven of Swords, it's a lie. It's a lie. I don't know what this is. Someone is lying. Clarify the Seven of Swords. What's the lie? Or what's she, what's, what's the seven? Clarify the Seven of Swords. Six of Pentacles, justice. This lie is coming out. It's coming out. It's gonna. It's, you're gonna find out. It's you are. Don't lie about shit, Libra. Don't think you can get away with it. It's someone is going to get caught, Libra. Clarify the king. Someone's gonna get caught. The King of Swords. Clarify the King of Swords. Judgment. Someone will get caught. They will. Clarify the King of Swords and Judgment for Libra. Three of Cups. Somebody is going to see you when they act. Is somebody is somebody's going to see it? Yeah, it's going to be a witness. So it's witnesses. Clarify the Three of Cups. Clarify the Three of Cups. Ten of Pentacles. The family is involved. It's something about the family. Something about family or money. Clarify the page of cups. Death. Clarify the page of cups and death. Okay. So the first story I heard in my head, somebody's going to find out that their child is not their child. But with these really good cards coming out, there's another story that's I'm, that I'm getting. Okay. I'm also hearing somebody has a twin and they separated the kids. That Somebody either has a twin, a brother, or a sister and they separated these kids. One kid, so one kid can have a better life and the other kid has a shitty ass life. I'm moving on, Libra. I don't, this shit weird. All right. I'm also hearing that somebody slept with brothers. So, so this woman slept with two brothers. Um, Libra, I'm done. I said I was done. Don't tell me nothing else for Libra. Um, Scorpio. 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 Okay. 
if we dealing with the Leo Scorpio. Shit. Four of Cups. And then the Moon. Will of Fortune. High Priestess. I mean, that, that is the Empress. Not the High Priestess, but she might come out. Okay, so Pisces Energy. Cancer Pisces, Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, Leo, Libra. Okay, clarify the Four of Cups for Scorpio. Page of Pentacles. Will you accept this person's apology? Clarify the Four of Cups and the Page of Pentacles for Scorpio. Okay, the World Card. You you probably will. You probably might open this door back up. Or some of you will close it because the world is closing cycles. Clarify the moon for Scorpio. The devil. What the fuck? Clarify the moon and the devil. The hermit. Someone is very depressed. Very depressed. I hear someone is having nightmares. Um, somebody is... Um... I hear somebody is being tortured. Someone is being tortured. I don't know if somebody's doing some type of weird magic or spell, but this person feels like they're being stalked and watched and haunted. I hear haunted. Okay. So clarify the will of fortune. The nine of pentacles could be dealing with the Virgo. We got the lovers at the bottom. I keep seeing strength. He could be dealing with the Leo. Clarify the will of fortune and the nine of pentacles. Strength right here could be dealing with the Leo. Somebody's doing witchcraft. Clarify the Empress. Six of Swords. Clarify the Empress and the Six of Swords for Scorpio. Page of uh, Ace of Pentacles. What the fuck is this? Clarify the moon, devil, and the hermit. Death. Somebody's talking to ghosts. Somebody's a wannabe psychic medium. Someone makes money from doing this. Okay. You could be dealing with this is all majors in one row. The moon, the devil, the hermit, and death. A lot of majors. All in one row. A lot of transformation. Then you have the world, empress, the wheel of fortune, and strength. I don't know. What the fuck you going through? Scorpio, excuse me. Three of cups. What the hell is Scorpio going through? What is, what's this whole next 48? Why are we here for the next 48 for Scorpio? Okay, it's for love. It's for love. Three of Cups, Queen of Cups, Ace of Cups. It's either for love, a child, self-love, or a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You're being tortured. I don't know why. You're worried about an ending? Clarify this energy right here, please. It's it's not making sense. King of Pentacles. You're dealing with an earth sign. So you, you're choosing between, or you're dealing with the Capricorn, Virgo, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. You're trying to choose whether you choose love or money but you want love three of cups ace of cups queen of cups you want love are you depressed king of pentacles clarify the king of pentacles this shit ain't making nobody sense page of swords you feel like somebody's watching you stalking you and they are. It's a private investigator. Okay. All right.
You're worried about somebody finding out something too. I don't know what it is, but you're worried about somebody finding out something. Give me a different story. Give me a second story for Scorpio. Queen of Pentacles right here. Could be done with an earth sign. The King of Pentacles had already came out. Five of Pentacles, two of Wands. Making a decision on love. Are you going to choose love or money? But I, for some reason, the Five of Pentacles, I don't know if you feel like you don't have a lot of money. Maybe you don't have a lot of money. You're penny pension. You lost some money. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. Money, stability. Clarify the Five of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. Clarify the Two of Wands. The Tower. Whoa, shit. The Tower. Clarify the Two of Wands and the Tower for Scorpio. This is your energy. The Knight of Swords. Somebody says something. Right. Okay. What, do they, what are they saying? Page of Cups. I like you. So as soon as you thought everything was cool, you were working on your money, everything was getting good, everything was being good with your money and all of this extra shit, um, you made a comeback in money. For some reason, I hear more money, more problems. So the more money you get, the more problems for some reason. I don't know what that is, but somebody's coming in to tell you that they love you. Clarify the Page of Cups for Scorpio. Six of Pentacles. It's all about money. Yeah, everybody's asking you for money. Everybody's asking you for money or a handout. All right, Sagittarius. Speaking of Sagittarius, here you go right here, Temperance. All right, Sag. Next 48 for Sagittarius. King of Pentacles could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Knight of Pentacles, King of Wands. And then the um, hair fit. So we have two kings. You can be dealing with an earth sign or a fire sign. Or you're a male who likes men and a woman who likes women. Clarify the king of pentacles for Sagittarius. Too many. Four of wands. Working on your stability. There's a relationship on the table. Clarify the king of pentacles and the four of wands. Seven of cups. But what will you choose? Who will you choose? Maybe you're choosing between a different... Maybe you um, want to purchase something and you have different options on what to purchase, when to purchase who to buy from, or your um, house hunting. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Two of Cups. Here's a relationship. The relationship may have slowed down with this Taurus or Libra because you're trying to get your life together or you're in the process of moving. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. Ace of Pentacles. Okay, here's the offer right here. Clarify the King of Wands. The Magician. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Clarify the King of Wands and the Magician. Somebody wants to use that magic stick. Queen of Swords. Page of Wands. You're trying to figure out, you probably have two people to choose from or two options to choose from. Clarify the hair fence. Yeah, you want to use that magic stick. That's all I see. Five of Wands, Three of Cups. For some reason, there's a lot of drama going on in regards to your dick. I don't know why. Clarify the Hierophant and the Knight of Wands. Seven of Pentacles. You're making people wait on the dick. Okay, we got the Three of Swords and the Empress. Okay, your baby mom is calling you for some sex. And you're like, do I want to open Pandora's box again? But I see you do. But I see you could possibly have somebody else on the side too. With the three of swords. This don't. I'm not saying it in, it don't end well, but somebody might not be feeling good after it's all after it all boils over. Next 48 for Sagittarius. The full card. You taking a leap of faith somewhere with the Leo. You having fun. Here's the Queen of Pentacles right here. King of Queen of Pentacles. Then here's the Queen of Wands. King and Queen of Wands. So I see you're going towards your soulmate. And there's a bunch of other people who've been waiting in line to fuck with you. They're not going to be happy about this. Okay? <laughs> oh, shit. 
you could be dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius. <laughs> Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Gemini. Pisces Aries. Leo. Capricorn. Capricorn, next 48 for Capricorn. <sighs> Everything is fine, okay? Moving forward, you're doing your own thing. But there's a decision you're making to make things fair. You're getting communication, something about love and a relationship, healing. You're making, you want to make things right with somebody, but they might not be with your bullshit. Clarify everything is fine. Clarify everything is fine for Capricorn. Ten of Pentacles. Something about the family. Two tens. Endings and new beginnings. Clarify that everything is fine. Ten of Swords and the Ten of Pentacles for Capricorn. Six of Pentacles. Okay. This was a loss, but I can still bounce back from it. Um, I'm seeing... Everything is fine. The money's still good. Clarify the chariot for Capricorn. Two of Pentacles. Yeah, I have money in different places. Clarify the chariot and the um, two of Pentacles for Capricorn. I hear I got holes in different area codes. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles. Okay, there is an offer on the table. It is. Clarify the hermit. Okay, this love that you have for somebody that you've been trying to keep a secret, it ain't no secret no more, Ace of Cups. And you miss them, Ace of Wands. Knight of Wands, here you come. Judgment, it's a Sagittarius. Here you come, you made the decision to do it. Seven of Swords with the strength. You've been playing yourself, lying and all this shit, trying to hold back. And I don't know what you've been doing, but it ain't been doing nothing for you. Clarify um, Judgment and the Knight of Wands. Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, you want that wheel to turn. You want to be in a relationship. You do. With the Leo. This is You want to be in a relationship with your sneaky link. Clarify justice. Queen of Cups. You have love for them. You love them. You do. Stop lying. You've been lying. The truth is you've been lying about your feelings for somebody. Okay? Or this is what they've been doing. Clarify the star. The Emperor, Divine Masculine. Come through, Divine Feminine, where you at? Come through. We have the lovers here. High Priestess, Nine of Pentacles. You've been getting the downloads. Can I get a can I get a download? Where she at? Come through, Divine Feminine. She not with your shit. She didn't come out. She ain't with it. Clarify the star and the emperor for Capricorn. Page of Wands. You're going to have to start off slow, big boy. You're going to have to. <laughs> Four of Pentacles. I ain't opening up. I'm not opening the door. You come into somebody's house telling them to open the door and they already can tell that you coming. They can feel your bullshit. Okay? And somebody you have a, con a strong connection with. You love them. You like them. Where's the Queen of uh, Cups? I think I put her back in the deck. But y'all seen her. You can be dealing with anybody, Aries, Aquarius, Libra, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Leo, Taurus, Virgo, Libra. Everybody came out. Pisces, Cancer. Everybody came out. All right, next 48 for Capricorn. What y'all getting into? Next 48 for Capricorn. <laughs> oh, shit, I seen her. Did y'all see her? Divine Empress. There she go right there. When I was um shuffling. Let's see what happened. Divine Feminine. Four Cups. Will they take your offer or not? Ain't no telling. Next 48 for Capricorn. Queen of Swords. 
Oh, they mad at you. They mad in a bit. It, 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 it. Oh, shit. They what? They not with that shit. They, you can't do that type of shit to them. Or vice versa. You can't do that type of shit to Capricorn. Clarify the Four of Cups for Capricorn. The Ten of Wands. Responsibilities, burdens, drama. Clarify the Queen of Swords. The Star. That cut that drama out. Come to me with love and healing. Love and light. With the Empress. Truth, clarity, and love. I don't want to do none of that sabotage shit. Clarify the devil. Six of swords. Clarify the devil. Okay, come through, divine masculine. Cut that shit out. Clarify the uh, queen of cups. Three of cups. You want a reunion. You do. Clarify the nine of swords. Ten of pentacles. You want your family back. Clarify the nine of swords and the ten of pentacles. The two of wands. You had to choose between work. So maybe your money was looking funny and you didn't tell this person. And you stop talking to them and you coming back to talk to them again. My bad, y'all. We dealing with the Scorpio. This person is very guarded against you. Nine of Wands, Ten of Swords, King of Swords. Here's the match again. The King and Queen of Swords. There's a, the match. But I feel like you two are both stubborn. And you two both probably can talk real slick with the words. Real slick with the communication. Here's your um divine feminine and divine masculine right here. But I don't know if somebody did something, said something, was not acting in a high vibration right here. But they are not down with the fuck shit. Four of Cups. They don't know if they, they like, I, I'm going to have to think about this because you, it's, I find it real funny that you was doing all this bullshit. You have to cut that out. Okay. You're going to have to cut the games. All right. Capricorn. Or your person. Whoever. All right. Aquarius. We are almost done. Next 48 for Aquarius. Next 48 for Aquarius. Oh, I'm so tired. Queen of Cups. You love somebody. Next 48 for Aquarius. Damn. Hold on, give me a second. Got it. <laughs> Three of Wands. What you waiting on? It's a secret <sighs> magician. Okay, and the Three of Cups. So I see you waiting on some type of information or some type of clarity. I see somebody could be traveling from a distance to secretly come come creep with you clarify the queen of cups five of swords self-sabotage you getting your feelings about something clarify the queen of cups and the five of swords seven of wands somebody hurts your feelings and it has you stressed out clarify the three of wands the four of pentacles it makes you want to turn your back and not open up to them this ending or this person from the past uh there's You could be so sabotaging yourself if you try to fuck with somebody from the past. I see you sneaking around with somebody from the past and it's going to piss you off because you don't drove all the way out here and just for them to piss you off. Clarify the high priestess. Seven of Pentacles. Your intuition told you to wait anyway and not do it and think about it. Clarify the high priestess and the seven of Pentacles for Aquarius. Yep. They said, do not do this. Make the better choice. But you did it anyway because you want some sex. You want some love right now. You want to be spoiled. Next 48. Clarify the magician. The chariot. Yeah, you're going somewhere. You manifested this communication, something opening up for you to have some fun, instant gratification. But I see it's not going to um, be anything that you wanted. I'm not going to lie. All right. Give me another storyline for Aquarius. Okay, you could be dealing with the Gemini, Cancer, another Aquarius, a Scorpio, Pisces, yeah. Give me another storyline for Aquarius. Yeah, you want some sex, some instant gratification, bro. Yeah, it's hot and heavy, bro. It's hot and heavy for you, huh? I understand.
Aquarius. Next 48 for Aquarius. King of Cups. You do love somebody. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. But there's a big daddy, a big boss who is more on your frequency and your alignment. Clarify the King of Cups. It's funny because the King of Cups is in the same position as the Queen of Cups. So you do want love. Don't let your emotions and your feelings um be to your detriment. Eight of Swords. Stop doing that to yourself. Clarify the King of Cups and the Eight of Swords. The Page of Cups. You have love for somebody, but you might be stuck in your feelings and you are drunk in love in your emotions. Okay? Clarify the High Priestess. Two of Wands, a decision to make. Clarify the High Priestess and the Two of Wands for Aquarius. Death. All right. You're scared of the unknown. Clarify the Emperor. The Four of Wands, this Divine Masculine or this Aries is your soulmate. Clarify the Emperor and the Four of Wands. It's just going to take some time. You don't want to take no time. You want it right now. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Clarify the Hierophant. The Ten of Swords. <laughs> Clarify the hair fin and the Ten of Swords. You funny then a bitch. You funny, Aquarius, because it's almost like you feel like God or the universe is um, making you go through this pain. When it's not them making you go through this pain, it's not. I do see a soulmate right here. Six of Cups, Ace of Cups. You feel like the past is your soulmate. Baby, you feel like you feel like you don't have nobody you know the universe didn't prepare anyone for you <sighs> clarify the ten of swords six of swords and seven of pentacles for aquarius the seven of wands clarify the seven of wands it's you this is a self-sabotage type of energy because of some type of some type of instant gratification that you want and that's what keeps fucking you up, bro. I don't know what it is. This nine of cups is like a selfish, smug, instant gratification card. And you could just be doing these things under the influence. And it always fucks you up because you're always under the influence and something fucked up happens. And you feel like the universe is getting back at you or some shit like that. <laughs> Something stupid always happens when you drink. Stop drinking. <laughs> okay. Or some type of substance. But you like it. I'm not mad at you. I drink my wine from time to time. Could be dealing with the Virgo, Scorpio. I do see love right here. Taurus, Libra, Aries. Cancer, Scorpio. I do see love right here. The Page of Cups. Ace of Cups. Six of Cups. The Ace of Wands. Eight of Wands. The Ace of Swords. I feel like you're on this never-ending quest for your soulmate. But you feel like you're on this never-ending quest for your soulmate. Because you feel like you've already met your soulmate. You'll never meet them again. So you'll always have to be searching. You don't have to search. They'll come. Yeah, the um, full card. Live your life. We'll have you some fun. And the four of wands. Your relationship, it's guaranteed. So you don't have to search no more. Once you stop searching, that shit will happen, bro. I see. There you go, right there, the hang one. Pisces. Next 48 for Pisces. Judgment. You're making a decision to heal because something that ended hurt you really bad. A Cancer Pisces or Scorpio or a Taurus Libra. Clarify judgment for Pisces. The full card you you took up you decided to take a leap of faith and the wheel is turning in your favor you manifested this victory and success and you happy reading over pisces clarify the star you got the best reading out of everybody the four of wands here's your relationship things are changed this is a love relationship that is dating mutual beneficial clarify the ten of swords for pisces 
the ace of swords this clarity is going to heal all of that ace of cups right here spirit is blessing you with your relationship the lovers ten of pentacles and the baby i hear you getting your wife or your husband and the baby clarify the king of cups for pisces queen of pentacles love and money clarify the king of cups and the queen of pentacles the five of swords can't nobody get in the way of this there's a jealous fire sign that don't like that shit i'm not gonna lie clarify the three of swords the three of cups three of swords and the queen of wands we saw the king and queen of wands so i'm gonna leave her out because we saw the king of wands that's the pair that's the match six of cups clarify the three of swords and the three of cups the world card a new cycle a new beginning clarify the empress the nine of wands clarify the empress and the nine of wands two of pentacles two options two people with the high priestess i feel like this person is mad at you because you chose somebody else when you know they're your fucking soulmate you idiots you idiot <laughs> you idiot you fucking idiot. <laughs> or this is them. You fucking idiot. You chose them. I'm your soulmate. Are you dumb? Okay. <laughs> Clarify the King of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, and the Five of Swords. Okay, the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, you working on what? And you don't have nothing to prove, like show for it. That's what I hear. You have all of this and you have nothing to show for it. That just went some that these shits be going completely left sometimes and it'd be like fuck. Alright. I see you get exactly what you want though, Pisces. I do see a love relate loving relationship. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius because Sagittarius got with their soulmate and people was mad than a bitch that Sagittarius got with their soulmate. But I'm seeing that you might have somebody else to choose. And I don't know if you know who your soulmate is or not. Because I'm getting a big, like, question mark. Like, fuck, who should I choose? Damn. <laughs> ah, you get exactly what you want. A choice, Pisces. The next 48 hours. You could be dealing with anybody. Everyone came out. You could be dealing with another Pisces. Scorpio, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra. Leo, Taurus, Pisces, Gemini, Taurus. Give me another reading. Um, Aquarius as well. Give me another message for Pisces. I feel like you you probably chose the wrong person and you're getting another opportunity to choose the right person. Next 48 for Pisces. Four of Pentacles could be dealing with the Capricorn. We have the Emperor and the Devil could be dealing with the Capricorn. Five of Wands, Drama, Justice, Libra, the Hermit, King of Wands, the Tower. Okay, something blew up in your face. Clarify the Four of Pentacles, the Moon, the secret that you tried keeping in and it came out. Clarify the Four of Pentacles and the Moon. Four of Wands, it came out that you do have a relationship or someone else is in a relationship. Okay. We got the Star, the Knight of Wands, Queen of Wands. Here's the King of Wands, the match. It came out again. But I don't know if somebody like, do you and your soulmate fuck with multiple people or both of y'all like polygamous? We got the Ace of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Here's the um, marriage um family baby you know stuff like that clarify the emperor for pisces five of swords conflict defeat fighting drama clarify the emperor and the five of swords okay the hangman okay you're mad because someone is making you wait someone is mad because you're making them wait clarify the hangman or the hanged one the fool you don't want to wait anymore you want to just go for it five of cups yeah you just want to go for it you want to be happy again clarify the devil nine of swords stress clarify the devil and the nine of swords two of wands an option a decision you're getting cold feet next 48 
possibility for a commitment you're getting cold feet clarify justice for pisces two of cups seven of swords three of swords three of cups you want to um <laughs> fuck around with other people first so you can like really know for sure is this something you want to do okay clarify the hermit so you're gonna go ghost for a little while yeah you're gonna go ghost for a little while and you know figure it out i need to figure this out take some time out and figure this out get some clarity okay so i see before you um say yes to this proposal you want to explore your options one last time just one last time could be dealing with an aries capricorn sagittarius aquarius scorpio aries pisces libra scorpio pisces cancer pisces virgo all right this is all i have for y'all let me pull a message for the collective and we will be out of here <laughs> give me a message for the collective please next 48 for the collective There was some off the wall messages. I don't know if I'm gonna use that deck. Probably not for a little while. <laughs> All right, next 48 for the collective, please. The Ace of Swords, the Truth, Strength, Ten of Pentacles, the Star, the Hermit. All right, clarify the Ace of Swords, this truth, this clarity. This could be you accepting something or declining something and cutting something off. Clarify the Ace of Swords for the collective. Page of Swords. It's information that you found out, information that somebody wants to tell you. Clarify the Ace of Swords and the Page of Swords. The Nine of Cups, it makes you happy. The Tower in the sun it's a shock something makes you extremely happy it's a surprise clarify strength six of wands yeah victory and success happiness can't nobody take this away clarify strength in the six of wands the tower didn't i just pull that out it's a shock it makes you extremely happy i hear celebrity overnight clarify the ten of pentacles the knight of pentacles Clarify the Ten of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles money as well. The Knight of Wands, Six of Cups. Okay, so. <laughs> and then the Knight of Swords, Three Knights, Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, Knight of Cups. So I'm seeing three options, three opportunities, three friends. Okay. Three siblings as well. Three brother, Three brothers. I'm getting multiple opportunities. These are three blessings that's coming to you. It happens. Boom, boom, boom. Back to back to back. Long money too. Six of cups. It's going to make you really happy. It's a gift. Okay. It's a leap of faith that you're taking. Do it. Clarify the star for the collective. We have um, death. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. Five of wands. And then... But the Ten of Cups right here. Yeah, something makes you happy, especially for a long time. Something makes you very happy. With the star, this healing, something ends. Ending the drama, ending the this Five of Wands, it's over. It's ending. The Ten of Cups, it makes you very happy. Clarify the Hermit. We have the Five of Swords. These are big changes. Clarify the Hermit and the Five of Swords. Four of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, Nine of Swords. Hmm. You guys, your happiness may not be somebody else's happiness. I do see a hater in the midst, but I'm seeing that you get to laugh at this hater because you have three blessings coming to you. I don't know why Spirit um, wants you to know that, or, but it's important for you to know. This hater, this Virgo, or somebody who's been trying to stress you out and make things harder for you, things are going to be made harder on them. You're going to be able to see that. Okay. Any other messages for the collective? The Empress. Keep shining. 
keep shining. Can't nobody stop your happiness at all. Because I see people trying to. If you were unaware of people trying to stop your happiness, people actually are. They some fucking haters. They clowns. They don't have shit else better to do. I have Libra, Taurus, Aquarius, Scorpio, Virgo. And this is all I have for you guys. I love y'all. Y'all be safe. Until I see you again, please check out all of your other readings. I'm going to take a little break. Um, I'll do a poll when I come back. I'll, I'll do a poll for y'all. When I come back, we'll see what um, sign that I'll do when I do come back from my break. And we'll start back up again. But other than that, I have a lot of content for y'all to watch and view while I'm gone. Until I see you again, you can like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, leave me a love donation, book a personal reading with me. I am open for personal readings. I can still do personal readings on my break, so hit me up. You can email me for a personal reading. You can donate to the channel. You can like. That really helps our channel. You can um, subscribe as well. That really helps us grow. Welcome to the family or welcome back, family. I love y'all. You guys be safe. Bye.